Hello friends! It's time to decorate the kitchen for Christmas, but first I'm making a pumpkin cheesecake for my boys with a very special ingredient. The recipe is linked below in the description box if you want to try this very decadent holiday dessert. While my cheesecake is baking, I'm going to start on this tree and you can see what a monumental task that is going to be. I bought this pre-lit tree in 2017, I think, and only used it maybe four times, but all the lights had burned out, so I literally ripped them off and replaced them. I love opening up these boxes of special ornaments every year. Some have been passed down and some I've made or collected over the years. Fabrics are really how I choose the direction I want to go, so I made a runner out of this paisley fabric my mother had given me, the same that I also used in the living room, because it coordinated so perfectly with my main inspiration piece this year. I fell in love with a gray plaid blanket scarf I found on eBay. I think they were $11, so I bought three and made curtains, a sink skirt, and two runners for the piano and buffet. I really liked that it was not a more traditional red plaid and that it would coordinate so nicely with my gray cabinets and the rest of my colors in this room. Now my cheesecake is out of the oven, so I'm going to set the table and finish decorating while it cools. I always bring out my Christmas china to use for every day during the season, and I'm using this J&G Meekin Romantic England and Johnson Brothers Old Britain Castles for this table. I'll put all the details in the description box below.
For my centerpiece, I actually tried a couple of different things. Then I just went back to this very simple wood board with fresh greenery, the birch yule log my granddaddy made, and I embellished that with pomegranates, pine cones, and dried oranges. Now it's time to take a look around. I've used mostly things that have been passed down and things that I've made or gathered from outside. So if you have any questions, just ask in the comments below and I will try to answer.
What reminds you of Christmas? A holly wreath hung on the door or presents strewn across the floor? Tall Christmas tree with baubles bright, which fills our hearts with such delight. Carol sung out in the snow, a snowman built with eyes aglow. Crackers pulled a song to sing, candles lit and bells that ring. Roasted turkey, which tastes divine. Rich fruit cake with an iced design. No, the most important reminder of all is the birth of a babe in an ox's stall by Ernestine Northover. Thank you.